No matter what you do, you have to stay in the fight. Somebody needs your help for them to see the light. Someone is depending on you to live your dreams. You have to show someone else what their life means. You are on the course and someone needs you to stay because how can you win the game if you're unprepared to play? This is week two, y'all. We about to get it started. Check this out. What we want you to understand today, I am a winner. At the end of the day, the biggest thing you want to understand is whatever you need to do in your life to get up your hill, you got to grind it out. You got to keep pushing. You got to proclaim that you are not a quitter. Quitting is for quitters, and that's not you. So what we need you to do, I know you might be going through something right now. I know you might be experiencing a rough time. But you need to understand that struggling is a part of your process. You say you have these big dreams, you have these big goals, you have these places that you want to get to in your life, but struggling is keeping you from getting there. No, it's really not. Struggling is molding you for the preparation that it takes to get up this hill. So whatever you got to do to make it, you got to push through the storm. The trials and tribulations are going to come. I, I tell you this, you can't get tomorrow's results putting in yesterday's effort so if you keep grinding and you keep pushing and you keep working your way through it and you get through the tears you get through the blood you get through the sweat see i think a lot of times we get to a point we allow our minds to make us believe that we can't do something i don't know if you ever worked out but you get to a point when you're working out that you're pushing as hard as you can and your mind tells you you can't do anymore your mind tries to convince you that you can't keep going but at the end of the day, you say you can't do one more, and then you do another one, and then you do another one, and then you do another one. And you're like, oh, man, I just did three more, and my mind told me I can't do it. I need you to change your mind about who you are in order to change your reality about who you can be. So you take this desire that's in you, this passion that's in you, whatever it is that you want to get to your dreams, I need you to harness it. I need you to put it in your heart. I need you to change your mind, change your mentality, change your reality. That's, that's the secret of getting to the next level. You can't get tomorrow's results putting in yesterday's effort. So the more you grind, the more you push through the storm, the more you push through your struggle, it's at the end of that hill. I need you to get up the hill. I think a lot of times we, we try to put up these big goals. We try to say, I want to do this, I want to do that, I want to do that. And we try to get all of it at the same time. Well, it doesn't work like that. See, you have to plan and then you have to execute. It takes one day at a time. One day at a time, put in the effort. You say you want to save $100. Well, you can't. Sometimes for, for some of us, I know for me, the $100 don't just come like that. Sometimes it takes us saving $2 a day for 50 days. If that's what you have to do, you have to plan. Set your big goals. You got your big goals in mind. I need you to set smaller goals to reach those bigger goals. And that's all it takes. If you put in the effort, if you put in the energy, if you grind it out, you can make it to the top of that hill. So what I need you to do, it's be imperial to build your empire. But after that, you have to be a light to show somebody else the way. This is Tillman checking out. Thank you. See you in week three.